What's up, guys? Tony here. And Anthony. Uh, with Anthony Hookah at hookahbro.com, bringing you guys another shisha review. This time, we're going to do Fumari's Spice Chai. It's like my fifth take of this shit today. Not even more than that, actually. Spice Chai, uh, 100 grams. Bought it at our local hookah bar. Hookah lounge, if Once you will. Once again, it's gone. Once again, yeah, there's nothing in here. Besides, like, a little bit of, a little bit of, a little bit of, you know? I know exactly what you mean. Yeah. Um, it's the same as it always is. Yep. Really juicy. I, I just Medium. touched the package and this juice all over my hand. So. <coughs> um, this, it smells really, really, really good. Really good. I know it's supposed to taste like... I don't remember. I haven't had chai tea in a while, but I know it's supposed to taste like that. But it tastes like um, those frosted gingerbread cookies that you'll get at, like, the bakeries of your Local grocery store. Local supermarket, yeah. Yeah. Yep, it's exactly what it smells like—a uh, frosted gingerbread cookie. Yeah, I haven't a ch had a chai tea in years, so I don't really. I bet it smells like that, but um, it also smells a little bit like cinnamon. It smells a little bit like the horchata, the tangies horchata, a little bit. Mm -hmm. But yeah, cinnamony, uh, gingerbread-like, and a little bit of chocolate even. All like, that juice. All that juice from the tobacco shows in the clouds, too. We're going to be smoking here. Yep. Um, I'm sure this is what chai tea smells like, but I haven't had one in a while, so all I smell is the frosted gingerbread cookies, which is a good thing. It smells really sweet. Definitely a good winter flavor. Yeah. Because chai tea, it's kind of like a hot chocolate. It's just different. <laughs> Tastes really good. Mm -hmm. Giant clouds. No. Holy shit. Ripping clouds. Ripping. <laughs> oh, and from the last review, the the um, Mystique Ice Tip snapped in half so I get it ghetto rigged <laughs> together. Yep. Uh, we're using the Mystique tip on our Nijum hose with the KM Hookah, uh, Harmony Bowl, uh, Heavy Duty Foil, one sheet, three Coco Gemras, and tap water in the base, and that's pretty much it. Um, it tastes... It's like a very mellow taste. Yeah, very like chill and sweet, and I don't know, you just kind of like chill around and just, just smoke and... Chill. Chill. It's really, really relaxing to smoke. Really smooth. It's like, it's like you're drinking a tea, kind of. Like when you drink tea, you feel relaxed. It's the same thing. Yeah. Like some, some, some shisha flavors will like, uh, make you, I don't know, not, this makes you more chill and more relaxed than most flavors would. But it has almost, well at least for me, it has no buzz. Which is weird because you'd think that the chillness comes from a buzz. But... Yeah, it doesn't really give me that much of a buzz either. It's just, uh... Actually, I have a little one. It's really relaxing. Yeah. Um, this is the end, almost the end of the bowl, so... It's like... Flavor strength at like the beginning to like the first 40 minutes is like a solid... It's like a very... It's like a mellow flavor, so it's very... It's not too strong, it's like a 7. But it... It's like the perfect... The perfect balance. I agree with that completely. If you put your tongue right up to the tip of the hose, uh, you can really taste it. Yeah. But even if you don't, you can still get a pretty good taste out mm -hmm. of it. It's a good flavor. It's probably, actually, um, I think it might have bumped Blue Gum Ball out as my favorite. Yeah, it is really, really good. Um, um, the first time I smoked it, I was blown away. Yep. Um... I feel like this flavor, unlike horchata, this flavor um, will be a good good crowd pleaser, if you will. Yeah. Actually, um, it was a good crowd pleaser. I smoked it on Super Bowl Sunday. Everybody loved it. There was like ten people around the, the table. We had the hook on. I know. That was fun that night. Um, so yeah, flavor strength, I'd give it a 7.5. Just the perfect... Um, Perfect flavor oh. intensity you can get. Uh, overall, this is one of the better flavors I've ever smoked. I'd probably even give it a, a 9. Ooh, 9. 
my really, favorite, really my new good. favorite flavor. But I have a lot of Tangiers coming, so I want to see if that any of those bump that out. We might even do an unboxing video of all of the stuff that Ant got from a, a website. Texas Hookah. Texas Hookah. Um, My first actually experience with them, so we'll see how that, that goes. Mm -hmm. um, total score, uh, I'd give it a solid 9.4. Nice. My new favorite. So definitely give this a try. I don't know... Um, I don't know. It's good. I was going to say something, but I don't know what I was going to say. Um, I don't think we ever went over like exactly what it tastes like. No, we didn't. It tastes a lot like gingerbread still. Yeah. We can still taste gingerbread, and uh, I don't. I haven't had spicy in a while either. I mean, I had uh, chai, chai tea. tea, but it's really sweet, but not too sweet. It has like a not bitterness, but it has a little. Um, you know, like when you eat gingerbread, it has that like same effect. Of gingerbread's not too sweet. It's like it's like cinnamon. -y. It has a spi it has a spice spice chai. Exactly. I wonder if there are a lot of the same like uh, spices and, and stuff in chai as in gingerbread Probably. because they taste they don't taste like a lot alike, but they're I don't know. maybe we get a gingerbread flavor yeah. and and uh, compare. I'm pretty cool. Oh yeah, I want to try a gingerbread cookie from Fantasia, even though I don't like Fantasia all that much. I heard it was good. So yeah, I think that wraps this one up. Yep. Um, like I said, it was a good crowd pleaser in our experience. Um, people be like, oh, chai, I don't know, that sounds kind of weird. I don't know if I want to smoke that. Instantly when I w let everyone smell it, they were all interested in trying it. Yeah, if, if you're not sure if someone's going to try it. If, let them uh, smell it and they'll, they'll want to. Yeah. It's like probably one of the best smelling shishas I've ever like dealt Smelt. with. I know, it sounds weird. <laughs> but it's like when I when we first bought it, we opened it up right away to smell it, and it was like, oh my god, I want to go home right now and just smoke it right away. And we did. We got a bunch of different flavors, but that was the one that smelled the best, in my opinion. So oh, yeah. we came home and just popped it right in, and it was delicious. So yeah, 9, 9.4. Yeah. All right, uh, Fumari Spice, spice chai. chai. There we go. There it is. There it is.